James Wine is James the Wine Guy, a very brief video on the wines of Austria. Stay tuned. a few Austrian wines, but I think it's really important to talk about the wines of Austria. It's one where I think it's only thought of as one singular variety, that is Gruner Fettlina, but instead there's so many varieties, including uh, these beautiful dessert wines, and it's a great heritage, it's a Botrytis-based uh, uh, sweet wine, it's fantastic. This one is called Kratzer, and we'll talk about these wines in their own respective videos. But on the map, I want to show you my handy-dandy iPhone 6, uh, Austrian wine regions. Now you'll see in right here, I'll bring that a little closer, that most of the wine regions in Austria are in the eastern portion. It's obvious that, that it is. And uh, so you'll see some near uh, Vienna itself. And you do have international varieties grown in Austria. There's about 51,200 hectares or approximately 126,000 acres. Now there are 16 wine regions in Austria. So 36% of all wine grapes grown in Austria are grown in Fettlina, so representing one-third of all wine grapes grown. You also find a significant amount in Zweigelt, Mulletogau, Blau Frankisch, Blau Portugieser, Driesing, Neuburger, as well as St. Lawrence. So you'll find a great variety and variation. You also find some um, uh, international varieties such as uh, Chardonnay and uh, Pinot Blanc, but it is a really handsome, gorgeous region, and I, I want to point out that on all quality wines from Austria, you're going to find the Austrian flag on top of every single bottling. And uh, I think it's really handsome, beautiful, gorgeous wines to grace your table with, to enjoy with food or not, to enjoy with desserts or not, and uh, to have a standalone drinks as well, standalone wines. Uh, so your cocktail parties can be graced with beautiful Austrian wines. It is a um, place that I've yet to visit in terms of visiting the wine countries. And uh, you know, it's actually pretty accessible. For me, Austria is the undiscovered wine country. Yes, I think for a while, uh, Gruner Fettlina was the white wine. I think it still is. I think it's absolutely charming beautiful gorgeous it is a respectable international wine and uh, I think it's for me I, I really seek out more Austrian wines because I think they're really important you know I think it's a great culture and uh, so a great experience and thank you so much for watching today again you're gonna see each of these in their own video reviews so do me a favor give a like to this video share this video put your questions in the comments down below and subscribe to this channel let's also connect on a variety of social media such as Facebook Twitter Vimeo Google Plus Pinterest LinkedIn as well as Instagram and WordPress thank you so much for watching today Stay tuned for more. Salut.